Welcome beautiful yogis to our kundalini yoga practice today. Today we're going to be working on the Vishuddhi chakra, the throat center, and it's the fifth chakra here in blue. And the Vishuddhi chakra is about the projective power of the word. And in Sanskrit, Shuddhi means to purify. So this chakra is about truth and purity. And it's associated with G. Um, the note G and the sense of hearing and the element ether and the color is blue and it's located at the throat and associated with the trachea, the throat, thyroid, parathyroid and cervical vertebrae and the organ of action is are the vocal cords and the organ of knowledge are the ears. So <clears throat> if this chakra is not open or balanced, the shadow aspects of this chakra are lethargy, weakness in expressive and descriptive abil abilities, shyness, voice problems, insecurity, fear of other people's judgments, throat problems, neck problems, thyroid problems, hearing problems. And if this chakra is open and balanced, um, this chakra is our center for truth, language, and knowledge, and the ability to communicate effectively. And this is about authenticity, healthy self-expression, and interactions. This chakra is about inspiring and in teaching, uh, truth, creative expression, and speech, writing, and the arts, and um, also being a good listener. Um, is one of the aspects of this chakra and the mantra for this chakra is the Sanskrit syllable here and the fifth chakra is hum and we'll chant that later in class to tune and balance this chakra also in the sacred solfeggio frequencies um, the 741 Hertz Tune, balance the throat center. So we'll just start by tuning in with the Adi Mantra. So just sitting with a tall spine, chest is out, chin in, creating some heat in the palms. <clears throat> and bringing the hands in a prayer pose at the heart center and taking in a deep cleansing breath. And releasing the breath. And inhaling to begin the Adi Mantra. Om Namo Guru Dev Namo Om Namo Guru Dev Here briefly and releasing the breath and just relaxing the hands down and we'll just come into chakra breathing so we're just sitting with a tall spine chest out chin in just bringing your awareness to the throat center and just imagine a blue light here shining clear and bright strong and healthy and we'll just imagine that we're inhaling and exhaling through the throat center, the Vishuddhi Chakra. Just inhaling deeply here, holding the breath mentally affirming I am able to calmly and effectively speak my truth and releasing the breath and here we're going to come into breath of fire and ego eradicator for a minute so we'll be 
Doing breath of fire, panting like a dog through the nose. The navel is the bellows. So stretching the arms up to the sky, fingertips on the pads of the palms, thumbs up, shoulders back, focusing at the brow point between the eyebrows. And we'll begin one minute of breath of fire. deeply touching the thumbs together up over the head holding the breath here squeezing mola bandha root lock squeezing from the base of the spine to the top of the head stretching the fingers out wide and exhaling sweeping the arms down and from here <clears throat> we're going to come onto the back and um, bring the arms out into, oopsie, knock the bottle over. So just bringing the arms out into a T, just bringing the right knee up towards the chest, over the body, towards the floor, on the left, and we're going to turn the head towards the right. Just taking a couple of long, deep breaths here. And then just coming back to center, extending that right leg to the mat, bringing the left knee up towards the chest, over the body towards the floor, or to the floor on the right. And just turning the head here to the left, a couple of rounds of breath here. And just coming back to center, and extending both legs onto the mat. And here we're going to come into um, stretch pose. So we're pointing the fingers at the toes, chin comes up to the chest. So you can either leave your heels on the mat here or raise them up six inches off the mat and come into breath of fire. So um, looking at the toes here and we'll begin breath of fire, panting like a dog through the nose. to the mat. Just taking a couple of long deep breaths into the throat center here before we move into the next posture, nose to knees. And here we're going to bring the um, knees up to the chest, wrapping the arms around the knees and um, <coughs> chin to the chest. Nose to the knees and begin breath of fire here. Panting like a dog through the nose. Last 20 seconds here, powerful breath of fire, keeping the um, nose to the knees, chin to the chest. to the mat, <clears throat> head to the mat. 
We're just gonna rock up and down on the spine a couple of times here. And roll up into our next posture and we'll be coming into cat-cow. So um, hands under the, the shoulders, knees under the hips, and we're dropping the belly down. So we come into cow, lifting the chest, lifting the chin, stretching that cervical vertebrae, exhaling, rounding the spine, pressing the navel to the sky and bringing the chin to the chest. So just moving with the breath here. Just imagine inhaling and exhaling through the throat center, just energizing this center with our awareness, keeping our awareness focused here and our breath. Stretching the spine, full inhalation, full exhalation. Inhaling, dropping the belly down, chin up, hold briefly. Exhale into cat, bringing the chin to the chest, navel to the sky, hold briefly, breath out. And inhaling back to center. And here we will come, sitting in rock pose, and come into lion's breath. So for lion's breath, we're going to be creating this vibration in our throat center. So we're going to bring our hands out into lion's claws, just tight, just bring them down to the lap, stretching the fingers out as wide as you can. We're going to stick out the tongue, inhale through the nose, exhale, ah, through the mouth. So um, <clears throat> we want to create that vibration at the throat center here. So. Lion's paws, bringing the lion's paws down to the lap. Tongue out as far as you can. Inhale through the nose. Ha, ah, creating that ha ah vibration at the throat center. So, and eyes are rolled up towards the sky. We'll begin. Ha. Ah. Ha. Ah. deeply closing the eyes holding the breath just mentally affirming I express myself clearly and openly and releasing the breath and here we are coming into shoulder shrugs so inhaling the shoulders up dropping them down on the exhale shoulders up. Exhale, relaxing the shoulders down, bringing the chin to the chest, coming into neck rolls here. Inhaling right ear over right shoulder, back of the head over the back of the neck. Exhaling left ear over left shoulder and the chin to the chest. Just moving with the breath. With 
throat chakra is associated with the thyroid gland. And the thyroid gland helps us to maintain our youthfulness and our vitality throughout our lives. And it's bringing the chin back to the chest and we'll reverse direction, inhaling back to the left, exhaling around forward right, just moving with the breath. chin back to the chest just pausing here feeling that gentle stretch in the back of the neck inhaling the spine straight holding the breath just mentally affirming I speak with calm clarity and confidence Exhale, relax the breath. And here we're going to come into easy pose. And <clears throat> come into spinal twist here. So just bringing the hands up to the shoulders, <clears throat> fingers in front, thumbs in back. We're going to twist to the left on the inhale, twist to the right on the exhale. So we're moving the head and neck too. You know, that cervical twist in, just moving with the breath. your next exhalation is coming back to center inhaling deeply holding the breath squeezing mala bandha root lock squeezing from the root to the crown and exhale relax and here we are going to come into cobra with breath of fire so coming down onto the tummy so either coming up here onto the forearms Lifting the chest, chin up, focusing at the throat center here as we come into breath fire. Or for a deeper stretch, pressing the palms under the shoulders, just lifting all the way up and just coming into breath of fire here. Coming into a twist, soft gaze over the left shoulder, looking towards the left heel, holding the breath. Exhaling back center, inhaling center, twisting to the right. Exhaling center, inhaling center, holding the breath, squeezing all the root lock. And exhale slowly back down to the mat. And we're going to roll over here and come get ready to come into shoulder stand or a variation of shoulder stand. So, um, for the full, full posture in shoulder stand. Just gently rolling up. Supporting the low back with the palms, just bringing the legs so they're perpendicular to the mat. Chin up is at the chest here. Um, a variation of this <clears throat> would be just rolling up as far as you can. 
whatever is within your practice today, or you could do legs up against the wall. So we'll be here um, for about 30 seconds. So just gently rolling up into shoulder stand, legs pointing up at the sky, just breathing long and deep here. And then we're going to scissor kick the legs, alternating one toe up over the head. It's alternating. The legs here. And bringing both legs perpendicular to the mat. And if you're comfortable coming into plow pose, just gently bringing the legs up over the head, palms into the mat here, rolling up onto the shoulders, toes up over the head, just walking the toes up a little bit further. Taking a couple of rounds of breath here. And then slowly coming back onto the back. Bringing the knees to the chest. Just rocking up and down on the spine a couple of times. And here we will come up. into Sat Kriya. So um, Sat Kriya to balance the chakras. So chanting is wonderful. Chanting, singing, very good for tuning the throat chakra. So we're going to be chanting the mantra Sat Nam and we pull the navel in and chant Sat, um, releasing the navel and chanting Nam. So just bringing your awareness to the navel as you chant Sat, to the throat as you chant Nam. So Sat Nam. So, sat is truth, nam is vibration, truth is my vibration, truth is my identity. So, we'll be here. <coughs> Chanting the mantra, sat nam, interlacing the fingers here, index fingers pointing up at the sky. Bring your awareness to the navel as you pull it in, chant sat, to the throat as you chant nam. So, we'll begin here. Sat, nam, sat. Nam sat, 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 nam sat. Nam sat, 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 nam sat. Nam sat, 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 nam sat. Nam sat, 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 
Nam Sat 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 Nam Inhaling deeply, holding the breath, squeezing all the body root lock. It's mentally affirming, I add value to every conversation that I participate in. And exhale, sweeping the arms down, just resting the hands in the lap. And we'll just be <clears throat> turning the head to the left on the inhale, turning the head to the right on the exhale. Keeping your awareness at the throat center. Inhale, sat, exhale, nam. Truth is my vibration, truth is my identity. After your next exhalation, inhaling deeply, holding the breath. Mentally affirming my inside, my insight is welcome, needed, and valuable. And releasing the breath. And here will come. And chant the mantra hum H A M here to tune and balance our throat center. So we'll just do a continual hum in G. into easy pose, sitting with a tall spine, and just imagine inhaling and exhaling through the Vishuddha Chakra, feeling the energy there, vibration, and all the work that we've done in this practice today to tune and balance the Vishuddha Chakra. Inhaling 
deeply, holding the breath and just mentally affirming I am a good listener and give others my undivided attention when they speak. releasing the breath inhaling deeply holding the breath and just mentally affirming I remain true to myself in all that I say and do and releasing the breath and thank you for practicing with me today our throat chakra balancing kundalini yoga practice um, feel free to meditate or um, lie down in shavasana um, whatever you need to do to nurture yourself and some foods that support the throat chakra my favorite blueberries blueberries blackberries plums blue corn grapes prunes eggplant and some essential oils that are, um, support the throat center are peppermint, eucalyptus, basil, chamomile, spearmint, sage, and rosemary. So thank you for practicing with me today. We'll close with one long satnam. Truth is my vibration. Truth is my identity. Bringing the hands into prayer pose at the heart center. Satnam. Satnam. Namaste.